What's going on guys? Welcome to day 8 of talking to the camera. Today I'll be having a guest as I promised a couple days ago. And we're going to be ranking our favorite Walking Dead characters. Our guest today is... What's up guys? My name is Coach. I go by um, Coach. But you guys can follow me at Father Independent on Instagram. Father underscore independent. You want to go first? Who's your friend? Uh, on the Walking Dead. Sh should we talk to tell them about the Walking Dead, how how it's the best show in the world, or do we just jump into it? You know what? You know, Walking Dead is one of the best shows, but I would not say it is the best show in the world. I'm going to just have to stop you right there. It, it's good. It's, uh, it's, the, it's the best show. It's, it's the best show. Nah, the 100 is the best show. We can debate that later. Yeah, so... I haven't seen it yet. You haven't seen the 100? No, not yet. What? Bro, you gotta watch it. It's pretty fire. I'm gonna, I'm gonna watch it. So if we're talking about The Walking Dead and we're talking about ranking, right? We already know Daryl's number one, right? <laughs> Ooh, you know, I kind of forgot. I kind of forgot about Daryl. I'm not gonna lie. But you're right. Daryl's definitely number one. He's number, number, number one. one. Yeah, I so, um, who would you say come after Daryl? After Daryl, I'd have to say it's Rick. I'd have to say Rick is number two. That's 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 hands down. Daryl and Rick are one and two. Ooh, yeah. I think is Rick number two. I'd say so. We counting, we counting Shane and and uh and the season two boys, right? Everybody. I think Shane was maybe. Ah. Uh, I'm debating between Shane and Rick. I don't know. I'm not. I'm not putting Shane's not on my list for top two. He's definitely not. I'm no. sorry. No, he, he's a good actor, but as far as character goes, I I don't like Shane at number two. Dude. Okay. <laughs> All right. Cool. That hurts me because you know Shane was the OG. I mean, we got different opinions. That could be your number two. It's not my number two. I'm gonna say Rick. I'm gonna say, you know what? I'm gonna say Rick. Although, like, when Negan came in, they kind of made Rick look like a, you know, Negan made Rick look like a bitch. So, and you know, like, Rick is just badass. Like, who, like, I don't know. But Daryl, he, he still kept his attitude. You know, he was still the badass that he is. Still had it going on. So, speaking that's of why Darryl, he's number one. Speaking of Daryl, Carol is pretty cool, too. I'd say she's a pretty good character. What do you think? Here's the thing. I ah, I know like the whole Walking Dead fans and community, we all love Carol. I never really did like her. I don't really care for her. What? I don't like Carol. I really do. I feel like she's always like the cause of something or some type of problem. She never want to stay put. She always want to do her. And then she almost get killed, and then just puts the whole group in trouble. All right, so you don't, you're not putting her on the top of the list. Uh, yeah, she's not gonna be anywhere near the top five. So I'm thinking, Daryl, Rick, ooh, Negan and Shane are like. Ooh. I, I kind of like Negan. I'm not gonna lie. At first, when he first came out, I hated Negan so hard, bro. Negan, Negan could suck my dick, bro. I hate Negan so freaking bad, bro. But now I yeah, kind of like always... Negan. I like Negan. Yeah, people who start watching The Walking Dead, I'm, not, I'm always telling them, you know, the biggest Walking Dead mystery is how the hell did the fans end up liking Negan after what he did in his um, entrance and his, his first appearance? How the hell do we like him? We don't know. Dude is so funny. I've been watching television shows for so long, bro. Like, every time they introduce a character and the character does something so terribly wrong that you're raging at him, I feel like there's always a, the season always ends there. And then after a while, we just kind of forget because so much time passes by, and then they change the, the way the character acts. So now we're starting wow. to empathize, and they put him in a whole different position than he was before. He's no longer in a position of power, but now he's in a position of redemption, basically. And we want that, we yeah. want to see him get redeemed. Yeah, that happens a lot. 
Yeah. Glenn wouldn't appreciate what you're saying, but yeah, that happens a lot. He definitely oh, wouldn't. I'm gonna say Negan is my third. Negan, then Shane. So I'm at Daryl, Rick, Negan, and Shane. Right now. I, I can rock with that. I I can I can I mess with that. I I agree with that list. I like I like the King a lot, bro. I like King. The King. Ezekiel. Yeah, Ezekiel, bro. The way he was introduced into the show, bro, he had a whole tiger and everything, bro. That nigga came out so badass, bro. Morgan and Ezekiel, Ezekiel oof. They good enough to put you to sleep. But I do like his personality. <laughs> I like his personality, fam. But Morgan's a really good actor. Bro, he's amazing. Yeah, you gotta give him that. He's really free. Even though he shows up so little in the series, he's a really freaking... He plays his role like a G, bro. Fifth person on my list would be. Yeah. What about Eugene? I, I I like Eugene, but I wouldn't put him like the fifth person on my list. The funny guy though. I, I, I fuck with Eugene, bro. I, I know we all hated him when he first came in the series, bro. And now you just you just gotta feel bad for him, bro. I like Sasha. Really nice. Oh, Sasha. Oh my god. She was a real one, bro. Sasha was amazing. The way she what went about out. Michonne? Michonne? I don't know. You, know. you know how I feel, honestly, to be honest? Like, oh, geez, I did not like her and Rick. I'm. I, when I seen that for the first time, like, what? I'm like, her and, how? I don't, yeah, I don't see it. I, I, I that just took me by surprise. Her and Rick, I was like, no, what are you guys doing here? But I guess it just grows on you. Accept it. I didn't really like it. I didn't like it. No, yeah, me too. Her and Rick was not it for me. They were once again. It was like the Daryl and Carol situation. I guess we just not we're just not agreeing with the fandom, or I'm not agreeing with the fandom. Oh, yeah, yeah. We're we going against the fans right now, Mike. Hey, man, if you got anything to say, say it in the comments, bro. I'm open to debate. But, yeah, back to Sasha. What do you think about her? Sasha was badass. I miss Sasha. I think I would put Sasha up there. Yeah. Too, but I don't know where, but I, I would definitely put Sasha up there. Honestly, I I think I put Sasha in top five. I think I'm gonna log Sasha in as my top five, as my number five, bro. That's your number five? Yeah. I there's no one I can think of right now that can fit there. I'm gonna say Maggie. You're putting, you're putting Maggie there. I think Maggie. Then I think then it'd be Sasha. Maggie and Sasha. And you can you can switch them around. It don't matter. Maggie and Sasha are are just there for me. I don't think I'd put Maggie as a favorite for me. So you're doing Maggie and Sasha? Maggie and Sasha. Okay. Um, you remember the What about guy? Carl? Are you going to put Carl there? I don't think Carl's making my list either. <laughs> He's definitely not. going to get hate. I don't I don't think Carl's has that much of an impact for me, bro. Um, but do you remember the name of the guy that Daryl had beef with that whole Negan season? Dwight. Yeah, Dwight. I, I fuck Dwight. with Dwight, bro. You like Dwight? I like Dwight, bro. I wanted him to. I wanted Daryl to kind of like forgive him. Dude, the fans don't like you because you're just against everything. So I'm looking at. All right, I'm 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 looking at Daryl, Rick, Negan, Shane. Maggie and Sasha, like I said, you can flip them. It don't matter. And I would say... Either Michonne or Carol. I have Daryl, Rick, Negan, Shane, Sasha. I'm putting Carol on my list and Dwight. So that's seven. Dw Dwight, Mike? Dwight is on your list? Dwight is on my list. Bro. Dwight is on your list. Dwight is on my list. Mike. Dwight is my nigga, like my homie from, like we never left, bro. You feel me? 
Jesus, I don't. Jesus is somewhere on my list. I don't care. Jesus will be somewhere on my list. I can see Jesus. I can see Jesus. You know, I'm gonna put. I'm gonna put Jesus after Michonne. I got three people left on my list. I think I already oh. know two of the final three. Oh. Morgan's got a spot on the list. Morgan. Morgan. Cause I I like his acting. I like the way he acts. Despite his character, I like I like his, the way he plays his character. Fair, fair. Morgan's definitely oh. on my list. Negan, Shane. Who's after Shane? Maggie, Sasha, yeah. Michonne. Like I said, Kara will go in there, and Jesus. So I have one more left. Okay, I think I'll put Jesus on my list too. I I'm tempted to put Eugene on my list. Nah, I keep looking, not because Eugene don't belong there. Oh, you remember Tyler James Williams character? Uh, he, why did they kill him so early? I know, bro. They killed him so way too soon. Nah. He, I actually like Tyler James Williams as an actor. I got my final one. All right. The governor. The governor. Hmm. The governor. He's all right. Why do you say the governor? It was entertaining to watch. Like, he was always like unpredictable. Like, this dude could be talking to you but kill you at the same time. The governor was so unpredictable. I'll, I'll say unpredictable. Okay. I mean, to each his own, right? I mean, I'm not really rocking with the governor like that. But if we're talking about villains, if if I were to pick a villain for my number ten spot. Everyone would fucking hate me, bro. Anyone that watches Walking Dead will hate, will hate me so much. But if I were to pick a villain, bro, it has Alpha is such a great actor, bro. Oh my god. Alpha is so great, bro. At her role. Oh my god, she's amazing. Uh, like, dude, dude, she's amazing. He's great, bro, and to play that role, it's just insane, bro. I was thinking Alpha for my number 10, but here's why I didn't pick her. Alright. She was too damn good as a villain. I, I hated Alpha, and I, but I did like Alpha at the same time. I hated Alpha when it was Alpha versus the group. Yeah. I like Alpha just alone. I feel like she should just be Alpha, but when she was going against the group, it's like, nah, because she's killing people, that she's making like threats. Too, she, so, she played the villain role maybe too good to a point where I, I, I hated her. I hated Alpha, but the character itself was so entertaining to watch. Alpha's great, bro. I, I, honestly, I think I'm going to lock her in as my number 10, bro. I'm sorry, there's a I, lot of great characters, but I'm locking her in as 10. Bro. I wouldn't argue with that. I mean, Alpha's, yeah, Alpha's good, man. I wouldn't argue with that. Uh, yeah, so you want to list your... I mean, I, what were you going to say? I don't like Beta. I don't like beta, but alpha's alpha's good. Beta was too beta for me. Get it? But um, no, no, no. You see, anyway, <laughs> it was too beta for me. Anyway, all right. But that's all right. that's my ten. That's, that's my ten. You want to say it one more time for the for the, for the record? for the viewers? Yeah. So my top ten Walking Dead characters: number one, Daryl; two, Rick; three, Negan; four, Shane; five, Sasha; six, Maggie; seven, Michonne; eight, Carol; nine, Jesus; and ten, the Governor. So my top 10, if I can remember it, honestly, I didn't write it down. <laughs> I had Rick, Daryl, no, I had Daryl, Rick, Negan, Shane, Sasha, and then I know I had Carol on the list, but I don't know where I had Carol. I had Morgan on the list. I don't know where I had <laughs> yeah, Morgan. <I'm> <laughs> I had Jesus on the list. I don't know where I had Jesus at. And Alpha was in my number 10. And I had Ezekiel. I think I had Ezekiel. Did I have Ezekiel? Yeah. yeah. Alright, yeah, that's my 10. Yeah. Is that really 10, though? Yeah, that's 10. 
You sound like you got 20 people on your list. What? <laughs> no, that's 10. Oh, uh, I think that's 10. Yeah. Um, so yeah. That's day 8 of talking to the camera. We went way too long. We went overboard. But as you can see, yeah. when I'm not by myself, it's pretty smooth. Pretty solid. But when I'm by myself, it's kind of hard. So I just have to figure out how to fill the air the five minutes. We've we've been going for 25 minutes, bro. For real? Yeah, 25 minutes, dog. It's been that long? That freaking long, bro. It's insane. Anything you want to say before we go? Um, it was fun doing this. Like I said, follow me on Instagram. And soon enough, I'm going to put my own YouTube channel up. But right now, just follow with my acting journey. And it's been good being on this video. Awesome. Expect me again. Thanks for watching and peace.